Mr. Hodo Nakamura, the governor of Nagasaki Prefecture, will deliver his words of prayers. On the occasion of Nagasaki uh, Peace Ceremony, I offer my heartfelt prayers to the victims of atomic bombing together with the residents of Nagasaki Prefecture. 74 years ago this day, a single atomic bomb that exploded over the city of Nagasaki deprived 74,000 people of their precious lives and destroyed the city in an instant. Even those who narrowly escaped death were left with incurable scars on their body and mind and health problems due to radiation exposure. Despite all, all the sufferings, people have made untiring effort to transform Nagasaki, which was once a burnt-out ruin, into a peaceful city abound with greenery. Therefore, it is our duty to protect peace that we enjoy today. With a conviction not to repeat the nuclear devastation, we have appealed to the world the misery and inhumanity of the atomic bombing across national boundaries and from generation to generation. And last year, Nagasaki hosted the Global Citizens Assembly for the elimination of nuclear weapons uh, for the sixth time, together with part uh, participants from around Japan and overseas, we adopted the appeal that uh, make Nagasaki the last place on earth to suffer a nuclear attack. However, the existence of nuclear weapons, which can annihilate the mankind many times over, is posing a threat to the future of mankind. The Intermediate Range Nuclear Forces Treaty between the United States and Russia uh, has faced a dissolution uh, this month without alternative mechanism. A new threat to nuclear arms race is mounting. Against this backdrop, this year the Pope uh, is expected to visit Nagasaki. Uh, the Pope issued uh, his anti-war card with a photo of a boy at the cremation pyre uh, with a caption, the fruit of war. We hope that the Pope will send a message uh, of the peace and the need to abolish the nuclear weapons. We believe that uh, that will uh, uh, become a great encouragement uh, for people uh, who seek peaceful world. I seek the Japanese. Uh, I ask the Japanese government once again to make all possible effort to realize a world without nuclear weapons by actively playing a leading role as the only country that has suffered the nuclear devastation. The average age of the atomic bomb survivors and those affected by the atomic bombing has exceeded 80. I also ask the Japanese government to pay serious attention to their needs and further enhance the support measures for them including a screening process for recognizing sufferers of atomic bomb-related illnesses on the basis of providing relief and programs involving those with the experience of atomic bombing. The day, August 9th, is an unforgettable day for the residents of Nagasaki Prefecture. It is not only the day of prayers, but also the day of pledge to vow never to allow the, the world to have a nuclear devastation for the third time. I hereby offer my words of prayers to the deceased victims of the atomic bombings, uh, which in the survivors and those affected by the atomic bombings, good health, vowing to make further efforts towards realizing a peaceful world free of nuclear weapons. August 9th, 2019, Hodo Nakamura, Governor of Nagasaki Prefecture.